Next drug is Deprodustat. Now before going to this drug, we'll try to understand one thing. Whenever hypoxia occurs in the body, there is less oxygen hypoxia. So when hypoxia is there, we want more oxygen carrying capacity. So what we want? We want hemoglobin. So how hemoglobin is synthesized? Hypoxia will lead to production of a compound called as hypoxia inducible factor. Now this hypoxia inducible factor, it will go to kidney and start producing erythropoietin. So when erythropoietin is produced, that will increase the number of RBs. So oxygen carrying capacity increases. Okay. So this is the normal thing. But normally, HIF hypoxia inducible factor, it is normally inhibited by an enzyme. It is metabolized or we can say inactivated by an enzyme called as hypoxia inducible factor proline hydroxylase. Proline hydroxylase is usually written as POD, proline hydroxylase. So hypoxia inducible factor proline hydroxylase is the enzyme which will inhibit HIF. So when this is in a better erythropoietin will not be produced. So this is a normal physiological thing. So what we have done is we have done developed a drug or an enzyme inhibitor which inhibit this enzyme. So if we inhibit this enzyme HIF proline hydroxylase. So what will happen? HIF cannot be inhibited. So the level of HIF increases. So when this increases the erythropoietin increases that will increase the RBC production. So this drug is approved for treatment of anemia due to chronic kidney disease. Anemia due to chronic kidney disease, we can use Deprodustat. But important thing is it is approved only on patients which are on dialysis. It is approved for patients who are on dialysis. Instead of giving erythropoietin, obviously we can give erythropoietin. Instead of giving erythropoietin, we can give Daprodustat. The advantage of this is it can be given orally. Whereas erythropoietin is injectable, it is given by subcutaneous route. Okay. Now Daprodustat, from the name you can remember, it is proline hydroxylase inhibitor. Proline hydroxylase static. So inhibit the metabolism of HIF and the name says OR means it is given orally. It is given orally and it is used in anemia due to chronic kidney disease. Okay.